Hello world, hello Philippines, hello mermaids and unicorns, boys and girls, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, we are going to be playing with some new makeup right here. It's not new new, but it's new to me, so... Okay. <laughs> Hi guys, if you're new here, my name is Jurgel B and I am a makeup hoarder, a mother of three boys and I just love anything and everything that's related to beauty and makeup. I'm telling you, I'm a makeup hoarder. Yeah, that's just the reality of it. So, um, before we jump onto the video, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up if you guys did enjoy it. So, alrighty, let's jump onto the video. Alright you guys, I am super duper excited for this video because I just love Lizzie McGuire. Um, I don't know how old I was when the show came out. So when I found out that Colourpop was going to come out with a Lizzie McGuire collection, oh my gosh, I, I know that I'm in a low buy um, makeup journey this year, but I have to have this. This is, it's, it's going to be a collection, you know, this is Lizzie McGuire, like this is my all time favorite Disney character because she was my role model she was my savior going to school you know so I love her this is what dreams are made of <laughs> oh my gosh I'm super super excited I, I keep saying that but I really am but anyways I only got three items from the whole makeup collection I got the eyeshadow of course the eyeshadow palette I mean and then I got the um, plumping gloss duo in the shade Ethan Graft and Gordo right there and then I believe I got the eyeliner the BFF cream gel liners so I this is gonna be my first time playing with the um, eyeliner in the color pop so and then of course later on it's gonna be a separate one but I'm also gonna be featuring the Gucci bronzing powder so I'm also very excited to get my hands on this finally I know it's been a long time coming I mean it took me weeks to actually receive this in the mail so now that it's here I bought this long time ago by the way when it came out like like the day it launched I placed my order right away but it took like almost two to three weeks for it to get here I don't know why but finally I have time to sit down and film so all right I think I'm talking too long but all right let's jump in into the video All right, so eyes are done. We're gonna move on to our cheekbones. Okay, I'm gonna be playing with this product right here. Um, it is by Gucci, and this is their bronzing powder. Everyone's been talking about this when it came out, of course. It came out a while back, but I just got my hands on, on it. So I'm playing with it now. So it's 
here you go very pretty this is how the packaging looks like here you go so bougie but I think you know the price you're paying for the packaging as well this is how um, all right so I got the shade number one it looks very pink to be honest so I don't know how this is gonna look like on my skin on earlier I did put um, powder like loose powder on the under eye area because there's a little bit of fallout from the eyeshadow but just that's the you know the glitter part that's why all right so I kind of want my eyeshadow and my bronzer to meet I don't know why I'm feeling that vibe today but It's almost like a blush and a bronzer at the same time so okay now let's move on to the lips I think I'm just gonna apply lip liner and then I'm probably going to use Gordo because I like Gordo more than Ethan Craft although he's funny and dumb you know but Gordo's my jam so as always I have these two lip liners that I'm going back and forth Let's go for soft spoken. All right, filled in the lips with that lip liner. Now let's apply Gordo. This is a plumping lip gloss, so. Let's see, it really has some plumping powers. I'm not much of a fan when it comes to plumping. Although, the Buxom lipstick, oh, I love those. Mm, smells good. Oh my god, this brings me back to those lip smackers that I was allowed to wear. That was the only thing I was allowed to wear. Great school. Mm, so juicy. Mm -mm -mm -mm. You know what? I don't have any blush and highlight on. Let me apply some blush and highlight. Um, since we're Alright, so the makeup is done. Now let's talk about the products that we used. First things first, the eyeshadow palette. Of course, I love it because I'm such a big fan of Lizzie McGuire. So I love the collection and that's the whole reason why I bought the collection. Because I am a big fan. I keep saying that, but that's just it. So if the color story is not for you, then I would say don't buy it. But if you're a Lizzie McGuire girl like me, I think it's... A collection that's worth it to keep it's definitely um, a collection for me so that's why I have it I love it of course um, let's jump in into the lip gloss I did not use the Ethan Graft lip gloss but I did use Gordo with the lip liner NYX um, soft-spoken and I love the combo I really do I don't think it has any color or whatever but it is very juicy you know and it's plumping and it smells really good it really when I was applying it, it brought back brought back some memory when I was in you know grade school with those lip gloss. So love this, oh as of course because like I said, I mean if you're not in the market for buying new lip gloss, of course I'm not gonna say go out and buy it. But if you're a big fan, again, I think it's worth it to get these collections. And then the eyeliner, uh, it's pretty cute actually. I thought at first, I was like, oh boy, what the heck am I doing here? Like, I did not understand the makeup look that I did, um, the eye look that I did, but, you know, it's a process. So you gotta trust your 
your instincts and your process so I mean it worked out fine I like this look actually it's pretty girly it's pretty Lizzie McGuire um, eyeliner color is pretty good this is in the shade fluffy I think um, pretty good pretty cute so I like it also of course everything Lizzie McGuire collection I love because I'm a big fan but um, with all these three products that I have in my hand I think I would definitely say um, go for this eyeshadow palette because the color story is cute it's perfect for spring and summer and like I said if you're a big fan of Lizzie McGuire it is a worth it collection to keep next one the bronzer okay so this is a very bougie bronzer okay this is very expensive this is over $60 um, if you want to splurge you want to give it a try I'd say you know go for it the packaging alone is worth the price the product itself yes um, but I don't like the smell on this one by the way it smells like I'm not gonna say it because you know I'm not gonna say it but it smells like roses and I love the smell of rose but not this kind of smell of rose like mm -mm, no not for me it reminds me of something that I'm not gonna say <laughs> but I don't like this smell um, it's a cute bronzer I don't know if I like it I really don't I need to use it more for me to appreciate it um, so I don't know I'm kind of on the fence with this product so if you're a big fan of Gucci and you and you're bougie and you like packaging and the aesthetic of it maybe you'd want to get it but product wise the color the shade I mean I don't know it, it somehow like when I was applying it, it felt like it was a blush more blush and not a bronzer for me maybe I got the wrong shade I don't know but number one is for sure the lightest Ugh, but it looked like it's pink you know it's almost like it's pink so I'm gonna try using it as a blush maybe I like it more but so far though I don't have any complaints on how it applies on my skin I mean it's very smooth um, but again the smell oh no I don't like this smell oh, okay so that was a pre pretty quick short video of playing with some new makeup that's new for me not really new new out in the pro market right now but that is it you guys thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you guys in my next video please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up if you like me or if you can relate to me I don't know all right I see you guys bye